Hi guys, I'm back again. I'm not sure if this will end up being two parts. It will depend on how fast I go. Big mech haul today. Um, Glamour Days launched today. I pre-ordered my stuff about three weeks ago. Um, I pre-ordered a bunch of stuff, almost everything. And then from seeing some swatches online, I was kind of like, eh. So I went back and axed like half of the stuff that I had pre-ordered. Um, so then I went today to pick it up and of course now I can play with everything. The thing is when I pre-ordered, um, I was allowed to see the stuff but I wasn't allowed to touch like anything. So I couldn't swatch anything so I was like, uh. So it was kind of more like a just looking kind of thing. But today when I went back, basically all the stuff that I had previously wanted in my original order, I ended up like adding. So I ended up adding a bunch of stuff. So this is big, kind of a big haul, I don't know, we will see. <clears throat> First I'm going to show these little gift bags that they gave me, probably because I ordered so much stuff. Um, they gave me these cute little bags for Christmas. I highly doubt I will use them, I most likely will keep them. Um, I got the ones last year too, the ones that came with the tartan tail, that were with, like the tassel. Um, I got four of those. I only had two this time. They had the little one and then they had this big one, which is super cute. So these are really nice, and they're kind of just like a satiny finish. Alright, so the first thing is going to be this, and this is going to be the primped out lip look bag, and this is in the luxurious pink. It's going to come with a lip pencil, a cream sheen lipstick, and a cream sheen glass. And this was $39.50. So it's going to come with this little cheetah bag, kind of like a tiny clutch that does not want to open. Is this even supposed to open? I don't even want to. I don't even know if this is supposed to open. I would figure it does, but it literally looks like it's sealed shut. Okay, I don't even want to bother with it, but this cute little clutch. So the lip pencil's a little one. And this is going to be in the color Great Catch. Yes, babe. No, I'm still making a video. So this is kind of like a pink. Yes, sweetheart. So this color is really pretty. It's kind of like a hot pink, but not, I don't know. So just a pretty pink color. And then the lipstick is going to be called Lickable. This is really pretty too. I love pink, so I had to get this. So that's really pretty. Reminds me like of a darker based um, candy ambient, maybe more like a moxie. And then this is going to be the cream sheen glass, which is super duper cute. It comes with a bow. And this color is going to be in Call Me Gorgeous. So that's nice. And I love these because these come with a sponge tip applicator. They're not like the normal dazzle glasses which come with a brush applicator, which I hate. So, and there's the... So, they obviously complement each other very, very well. So, I think this kit is definitely a winner in my eyes. Very, very cute. Okay, let's see. Alright, so the next thing that I picked up was the pink brush set, and it's the Perfectly Plush Brush Kit at Vans, and this was $49.50. And this comes in this cheetah print makeup bag. Oh, it's so cute. Look at this. 
I didn't even actually see the inside of the bag because I didn't have the bags out, but super cute. Put some stuff in here. Put pink in there. So this is adorable. And it says L. Goldwyn. So I'm guessing she's whoever um, designed this. And then these are just the brushes. It's got a two a two twelve. A 239, a 217, a 168, and a 167. And yeah, mostly these brushes kind of suck, you know, because they're just mass produced, they're not handmade, like they're normal brushes, but I really couldn't pass up the pink candles. So, super adorable. Alrighty. And then I only picked up one of the actual little pellets that they had. Um, they were, I mean, all of them were cute, but this is the only one that really grabbed my attention. So I didn't go crazy. And this was the warm palette. Um, and this just has, I guess, eyeshadows. And then it says a brush in there. So I guess both eyeshadows. And they look like this. This is obviously like the cutest holiday collection I think Max put out so they've gotten a lot of rave reviews about it because it's just I don't know it's just cute and chic adorable so and the little bow right there super cute as well so this is going to be what this one looks like gotta zoom in so you guys can see better ooh as my light goes out Hold on, guys. Woo! I'm sorry about that. So that's what it looks like. But it was really, really cute. I love, like, the gold and the maroon colors over here. So I'm going to do some quick swatches. neutral eyeshadows. You can honestly barely even see them on there. Really light. And these are the two dark colors which I really liked. Those are a lot prettier and nicer there. So that is that kit. Again, I said it was the warm eyes. Go ahead and zoom back out here. And these, I think, let's see, they were $39.50 for these little ones. Right, and then I picked up two of the, well, the, the two skin, mineralized skin finish that they had. Um, these obviously were released a couple of months ago, but I never picked them up. They weren't really. They didn't seem that great to me, and then, oh, after, of course, afterwards, I was like, oh my gosh, I want them. So I'm glad they were re-released um, in this collection, or relaunched. And this is going to be the Whisper of Guilt. Looks like a lot. And it's just kind of like a, a highlighter. And these, I believe, were $29.50 or $29, if I'm not mistaken. And then the next one is the Superb one. There's another one that they didn't release. I believe there are three of them. The other one was like a really dark, darker colored one. So that one looks like... That one's a little bit darker than the previous one. This one's more like a rose gold. So I'm excited for these two. Alright, and then the next thing I picked up, let's see. So all the stuff I've showed you guys 
I've showed you guys so far has been the stuff that I actually pre-ordered. I haven't gotten into the stuff that I added to it. So the next thing is going to be the lipstick in Outrageously Fun. And this is kind of like the hot pink lipstick. Looks like that. Kind of like a hot pink magenta. And it's going to be a cream sheen lipstick. So that's what it looks like. It's really pretty. 